Laura, when I was a child, I used to blow up frogs. Now I blow up Iraqis. What fulfills a childhood dream of mine, Laura? I know, George. How do you dress me, you filthy, sleazy first lady of the night? I meant I know, Mr. President, sir. You know what I think of war, don't you? War is your midlife crisis of sending young men whose vitality you are jealous of off to suffer and die. What did you say? I'm sorry, Mr. President, sir. Your power as leader of the free world, who single-handedly captured Saddam Hussein and conquered Iraq, has made me so sexually excited and lightheaded, I just don't know what I am saying. That's what I thought you said. Now, let's do our quiz. Who is Ken Lay? Neither of us has ever heard of him, sir. Very good. Now, who is Chalabai? He's the Iranian-connected agent who gave us false information about the existence of weapons of mass destruction in Iraq that we used as basis to remove Saddam Hussein without evidence these weapons existed, thus allowing Iran a true nuclear threat to be the supreme power in that portion of the world. Sir! What did you say? Please, George, no more. We've played this game too long. Game? Game? You think this is a game? Do you know what I did to pledges in college? You branded them on their buttocks, Mr. President, sir? I branded them on their buttocks. Maybe you would like a taste of what that felt like. Actually, that would be kind of kinky. I mean, no, Mr. President, sir. Band over. I already am. <clears throat> Another midlife crisis. Holy crap. I'll prepare the press release. What nation are we invading? Iraq, Iran, Iraq, Erodium. Oh, you pick it, I'm so hard. Eh.